Hey, what's up? Um, so basically, I was going to talk about the uh, Tony Williams five note ride simple pattern. Um, for those of you who don't know, uh, when Tony Williams plays like really fast jazz, um, like the Miles Davis second quintet, he can play five notes in his ride simple pattern in a row. Uh, well, normally people can only play three or only choose to play three. Tony Williams made like his own technique uh, to actually play five notes on the ride cymbal at, at fast speeds. Um, the easiest way to explain this is probably that it's like the finger technique. If you've checked out the Jojo Mirror DVD, he talks about uh, it's like the volving motion or like push pull. So the basic motion is just releasing the stick and then bringing it back with your fingers. So. So that's basically the motion that you use, and so uh, you can practice it playing big doubles. So you get really good at that, and then eventually you can do three, and then that's how you'll play your fast ride cymbal pattern. I know some guys only go like, they mostly just use their fulcrum, but like I think this is the best way to get control of the ride cymbal at these speeds. So it's like... Uh, so double, double cat. So Bo go chain, de go chain. So that's basically it. So then what Tony does is he basically adds an extra two notes in there. So what he does is he goes. So there's an extra catch and release. So he goes. way to practice it is to just I don't know set the set the metronome somewhere like 150 or something so it's like just something easy so you can you can get used to your hand opening and closing like that and it's gonna take a while to get used to like I've been doing it for about a week and a half now and I'm still not really that good at it because I've really been practicing it every day but uh if you just keep doing it every day, it'll help. Eventually, sometimes my tendons will get a little bit tired, and I can't practice it like three days in a row, but I can do two days in a row and then take a day off. Um, but the whole point is to, to keep your hands super relaxed. You don't want to be like grabbing the stick really hard and going like that or whatever because it doesn't work, and your hand will fall off. Uh, so basically, that's it. So just practice this really slow. And eventually, uh, you'll you can work up to speed. So yeah, for sure, go practice it. That's basically it. Mine's not very even yet, but it's getting there. So.